Hello my friends and welcome back, it's episode 56. I'm learning all new things about XCOM thanks to my, uh, the fact that this is Iron Impossible Iron Man and that I'm skipping missions. Double time! Location confirmed. As you direct. Pretty obvious that I should just uh, leg it to the high ground. On Overwatch. Okay, there we go. Your team is compromised. We're picking up Advent response forces inbound on your position. along on the ground level is probably risky. On my way. Let's have a look. Drop in. Oh, an officer and two goons. Got some advent here. Might be safer to just kill them. Especially after that hit. Fifty eight, I hate to think how bad that shot was. Ah, oh, I kind of wish I'd uh, upgraded the Templar now, right? Vigilant is great for these missions.
seems reasonable. Overnight. Run, 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 run! I'm on it! Yeah, I thought about fighting them, but actually I really don't have the tools. It would be bloody and messy. straight line along the edge of the map and it's worked. <laughs> it's literally just walked, just edged the map. Already there. I'll go quickly. Roger that. Cause all the pods are between you and where you're supposed to be. So sometimes you can just avoid everything by just going around the very edge of the map. Especially if the map is very big. I'm sure my pursuers right now are like, oh, there's a load of lost. You got a little bit too close, my friend. Would you look at that? There's a ladder right there. Location confirmed. I see the path. We'll do. The situation could not be more perfect. Affirmative, covering now. Unfortunately, these boys are actually, uh... Absorbing my Overwatch fire. That's how it's done. No. Oh. If you missed on that 10% chance, I would be... Very sad. I'll lead the way. Rolling out! I'd be a very sad man if you missed. My day would be ruined, my sadness would be manifest. Oh, a codec. Codex. They're shifting their attack! Which has been uh, made active. Oh, nice shot! Damn! You could blatantly be killed by a lost. Wouldn't that be funny? But no, the lost ignores you. I guess a being made of some kind of translucent light is not exactly a nice dinner. The power guides me. Location confirmed. You get nothing. Eva confirmed. Making my exit. Blomp, blomp, blomp. Mission complete. All members of Wraith One have been successfully evac. Oh, I'm coming for you, Hunter. I'm coming for you. He's not going to know what hit him. 
Bailey and sure know how to turn a planet into a Halloween theme park. Zombie swarms. Just what we needed. Oh, reward. Heavy weapon. Interesting. Our action together is complete, Commander. Our unified resistance continues to learn a great deal about these Chosen that pursue us. The resistance found a way into the Chosen stronghold, Commander. Our troops are ready to deploy. We should launch a strike as soon as possible. Okay. Reduce avatar project. Plus three hacking. Reduce avatar project. Free promotion! Sweet. And there's a promotion for this one too. This actually seems to be the better mission. This guy might be the better specialist than Glitch, but Glitch has a bond with uh, my character. And that does provide some benefits. The super bond. Right, I've only got one Grenadier that's, like, high level, so... Let's go ahead and promote this Grenadier. You're gonna be needed. Our order is clear, and we will obey it. The aliens continue to get shrekt on the Avatar project. Yeah, I lost, uh, by giving up that council mission, I actually lost a contact. Which is, in a way, it's beneficial because the facility is in a region I couldn't contact because I didn't have enough contacts. In actuality, I could have potentially, um... Now I could now potentially contact the region that's got the uh, the facility in it if I needed to, if I wanted to. I'm just talking from a grainy, you know, from a wider strategy perspective. I really don't need to do anything, but you know. These are both nice. Okay. You have a bond with the Templar of all of all people. It would be interesting if I ever decided to use the Templar. There'll be many ranks before the Templar is useful. Well, I'm not taking him on the mission anyway. Well, let's hang on before I make that decision. We got some decisions to make, so let's make let's make those decisions and let's have a look at things. We have um, hail of bullets, aim, rapid fire, and untouchable. I actually think glitch is better. Run and gun is nice. Blast padding is nice. Then we have hail of bullets as well. Uh, 
I only have 9 AP, so there's actually very little I can do here. Yeah, the decision is to whether you think rapid fire is better than run and gun. Because aim is garbage. And untouchable is nice, but you really want offensive abilities, not defensive ones. And plus, if you've got it running, more often than not, the aliens will just target someone else. So... No soldiers are eligible for improving bonds. Why is that? Let me, let me go! <laughs> okay. Hello, Commander. We're ready to kill the Reaper. Let's just grab this intel first and see if there's anything else we can do. Another important step forward in our research. Plasma Lance, Shadow Lance. Oh, Datapad Decryption inspired. Great. Science is eager to begin, Command. The science is eager to begin. When inspired, our team is actually quite efficient. I await your orders, Commander. The Warlock weapon is inspired four days. I foresee a number valuable applications stemming from this technology. I'll have a report assembled as soon as the research is complete. Right. I'm going to the black market. Alien facility coordinates locked in, Commander. Sweet. Strategic resource located. 41 intel. That was a waste of my time. Avenger plotting new course. 41 intel was a complete waste of my time. But whatever, we had time to burn. Should probably start killing facilities, shouldn't I? Market is open. Alloys, all they've got. I should probably put the instant contact back on. Although actually, I don't really have to. I mean, building relays and making contact is, you know, whatever. Of wealth beyond measure. Hey, Commander. Right, is there anything I can make with this alloy?
That requires just alloy. Crystals. Crystals. hit the warlock now, right? There's really nothing stopping me. Nine days until the supply drop. We can continue to power up, but I don't need... I don't need the... I don't need the plasma sniper rifle to, uh, to get the job done. I think we're capable of killing him fine without it. Avenger plotting new course. Let's get set up and ready to, to, to kill this guy. going to be a dumb string. He is kind of weak, you know, Mox. I hope he gets some nice abilities at friggin' Colonel. This is totally maxed out, yep. Nah. Still some some nice abilities left to grab, but you know. Missile, do I really need a grenade? Let's go ahead and poison the crap out of him. Superior scope, now we have superior expended magazine. Advanced repeater. You know, repeaters on weapons actually are pretty funny against the Chosen, because if you accidentally repeat him to death, that can be very entertaining. I'm still in two minds about using a, a high-grade plasma rifle. 
But I'm sure once the Chosen's assault rifle comes along, it will be an easier decision to make. As it stands, the incredibly high damage output of this weapon makes its unwieldiness worth it. I would rather have a heavy weapon than a grenade. That's what I'm doing, is I'm trading... Um, I'm, I'm trading... Uh, grenades for heavy weapons. Is this weapon perfect? Getting closer though. The only issue with doing this is that I'm going to lose out on my uh, my volatile mix grenade, but uh, I'd still rather have a blaster launcher than a than a volatile mix grenade. So. He can summon droids. Stick with talons. The old serpent armor is here. Superior auto loader. Would rather have the expanded mag. Okay. I think that's everything. I think we're ready to go. There's definitely a temptation to run two snipers, so you've got two sets of uh, face-off. Face-off is just so good for cleaning out swarms. But I don't think the hunter is going to summon swarms like the friggin' psychic guy did. He'll summon units, but I don't think it'll be that many. I wonder if I should swap these around. No, because he usually only gets one attack. Whereas this character gets many attacks. Stacking critical would be useful. Okay. That's it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. we got a hunter to, uh, to put down. And then after that, we've basically just got story missions to do. So that means we're going to start doing Shadow Chamber stuff. And I don't know, I'll start recontacting regions and building relays and maybe taking out facilities, whatever. Whatever. Instead of just burning time. But we do need to burn time. It's the only thing we really need to do. So, alright, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys next time.